What's up guys and welcome back to another League of Legends uh, gu build guide and tips. So this time it's Ash, uh, as I told before, but I did go must yeast. So now we have Ash. Ash is a, is a she's a good uh, archer. Pretty weak and pretty slow at beginning, so kind of want to build up uh, with the uh, AD and movement speeds and some uh, attack speed. Let's see, I'm going to kill. As you can see, I take a lot of critical. It's when you come with like an quest, not a question mark, but I don't know how to say, it, but this. As you can see, out of second, it's in Swedish. Uh, but anyway, as you can see, I build it when I shoe. I have a boot of speed. And then I did immediately go to the infinite edge. She gives you 8 attack damage, 25 critical chance, critical strike chance. And then they go Phantom Dancer for more crit and the attack speed and then we have some moment speed and then I did go to infinity edge so it's pretty straightforward only like uh, attack damage for Ash and her uh, abilities will also gain, gain stronger or be stronger whatever she doesn't go on abilities so you can see fires an arrow fires arrow in the cone dealing 80 Plus 338 physical damage, volley applies, frost shots, slow effect. So she needs a lot of AD to become stronger. And uh, at the shoe, I did go for magic resist. So I can uh, take a lot of more magics or whatever you want to say. But you can go like, it depends on who you're meeting. I'm using Sona again, as you can see. And she have a lot of magic penetration. Uh, magic resists and all that kind of stuff so you can go cooldown you can go penetration you can go attack speed even armor you can go for the boost of mobility boost of swiftness which is recommend recommended for her but i think this is best for her uh, so you have some magic resists because this is an expensive uh, uh, set of uh, things but you can go pretty much uh, however you want you can go phantom as a first and then infinite edge like all the way you don't have to buy free I don't I don't know if you're going to have a four for that but you kind of go for what you can and uh, hit her from here I don't know if you can if she stays there I can hit her I guess see how much damage they will take there we go took uh, pretty much damage it's minions as you can see after that 598 768 as you can see that's the critical when it say when they have like the uh, I don't know as you can see after it be it becomes because I have a lot of crit so you get it a lot it's even better than attack damage because when you got a lot of crit you can go how high as hell how is it possible I meant <laughs> and I have hundred percent critical chance so it will become a critical almost every time, pretty much every time. And dang. all right, so I think I no the dragon is dead. I killed him before. Um, see for I recommend to have blue, uh, you know the blue buff for Ash because she she costs a lot of mana. I can show him him. See how much it takes. Seven hundred forty-nine uh, all the time. It's the crit and eight hundred fourteen on those. On those, so it really fast kills. You see here, take them. Almost one eight hundred and seven. So we're going to lose that turret. We are, but you see how much to take on this hundred and three. It's pretty much. Can even take this out alone. There we go. Just lost some uh, damage, a lot of damage, but oh, seven on it. Some crazy crit I get here, and so on we come. So I have to be careful, but I can kill her, can stun her, and uh, just harass her with uh, my crits. So there you go. Didn't take so long. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much the build set for Ash. I take. Uh, it's an expen as a expensive build, but. Uh, uh, you can use her E as I max almost at first. I 
take this one first and then I do this. So when you have full, you will uh, you gain extra 5 golds for every kill, even if it is a minion or champion. So you will gain 5 extra. So that's really good. If you want to. And then you can use, if you want more attack speed, just buy another Phantom Dancer. Let's see over here, how fast I am now. 1551 attack speed. And it's pretty fast. Just you can see 5 gold, 5 gold every time. You go find gold all the time almost. One shot them and you have this you can uh, show an area. So that's pretty much my build for Ash. Uh, she's an archer. She need a lot of damage, so the enemies won't get too close to you because they will uh, lo uh, lose a lot of damage or health. I meant not damage. So it's pretty easy. Easy to get kills. Uh, you, you will be harder to gank, I guess. You can be ganked by all of them, but uh, I think you will get a, at least some kills, like one or two. You will do a lot of damage to all of them. See how much health she have, and you can probably kill her by your own. And I just missed by some uh, millimeter. But uh, yeah, that's my build, building guide. So thanks for watching. Uh, please. Like and favorite if you enjoyed, uh, even if it ever, even if it helped you. So, even I meant, uh, I don't know. Uh, if it helped you, I meant not even, but I think this will help you. But if it helps you, uh, I'm happy to to do that. It help you. I mean. Uh, I can't talk right now. No, no, I'm so freaking hungry. And when you're hungry, you can't speak. Uh, it's like that for me, I don't know, for you guys, but this is probably the best tip I can give you. Uh, movement speed, attack speed and damage is pretty much what she need. You don't need ability power because she doesn't go on ability power, so it doesn't matter how much ability you have on her, she won't be stronger for that, so go for that and uh, leave a comment or if you have another tip, you can leave a video answer if you want to, you can send me a private message. If you have better tips so we can uh, help other people who like to play Ash or even other guy, uh, even other champions. So thanks for watching and 